Since the start of production, the generation of engines developed by the PSA concern in 2006 to 2007 and slightly modernized in 2010 was installed on the model, a VTI engine with multipoint injection and throttleless intake, with a volume of 1.4 and 1.6 liters, and a THP engine with direct injection and turbocharging, volume of 1.6 liters. The VTI and THP four-cylinder engines for 2010 were the latest generation of PSA gasoline engines. Both motors are assembled on a common aluminum cylinder block, with a chain drive of a 16-valve twin shaft timing and hydraulic compensators in the valve drive. There are no balance shafts. The engine cooling system uses a variable displacement water pump and an electronically controlled thermostat. The design differences of the motors are in the timing device, power supply, and control systems. For cars for non-European markets and Russia, an engine of the traditional design of the previous generation, with a volume of 1.6 liters in 2002, was optionally offered. This motor is not structurally related to the above two. VTI motor. Technical features, displacement, 1,598 cubic centimeters, 77.0 x 85.8, Slash 1,397 cubic centimeters, 77.0 x 75.0, compression ratio, 11.1 power supply system, multi-point injection, for nozzles. The gas distribution mechanism implements the possibility of complex control of the intake and exhaust phases according to such parameters as the height of the intake valves, the width of the intake phase, the phase shift of the intake and exhaust. The phase shift is carried out by hydraulic phase shifters located on the intake and exhaust camshafts and working independently of each other. The gas pedal is electronic. The engine is controlled by changing the height of the intake valves with a simultaneous change in the width of the intake phase. This function is implemented by a combination of a stepper motor and a special camshaft acting on the intake valves through a pushrod system. The complex phase control system allows the motor to operate in the vast majority of modes without the participation of the throttle, which is constantly in a fully open position. This technical solution reduces the intake resistance and thereby increases the efficiency of the motor. The environmental class of the motor is Euro 4. It is produced and installed on the Peugeot 308 in two working volumes, 1.6 and 1.4 liters. Both options are structurally identical and differ only in the crankshaft and connecting rod piston group for a smaller piston stroke. THP motor. Technical features. Displacement. 1,598 cubic centimeters. 77.0 x 85.8. Compression ratio. 10.5. Power system. Direct fuel injection. Turbocharging. Twin scroll turbocharger with autonomous cooling. There is an electric fuel pump in the gas tank and a single mechanical injection pump for a common fuel rail, located on the blockhead and driven by the intake camshaft. In the gas distribution mechanism, the hydraulic phase shifter is installed only on the intake camshaft. Valve lift and intake phase width are not adjustable. The gas pedal is electronic. The motor is controlled by a traditional throttle valve in the intake tract. Thanks to the twin scroll turbocharger, the exhaust gas flows from the two cylinders in series do not interfere with each other at the end slash beginning of the exhaust stroke, which leads to more efficient cylinder cleaning and more efficient operation of the turbocharger. And direct fuel injection allows you to work on lean mixtures, which has a positive effect on fuel economy. The environmental class of the motor is Euro 4. Motor 2002. Technical features. Displacement. 1,587 cubic centimeters, 78.5 x 82.0, compression ratio, 10.1 power supply system, multipoint fuel injection, or nozzles. The gas distribution mechanism is a 16-valve twin shaft driven by a toothed belt. There are no systems for changing and controlling the valve timing. The gas pedal is electronic. The motor is controlled by a traditional throttle valve in the intake tract. The environmental class of the motor is Euro 4. Diesel engines. The car was equipped with the third generation of HD diesel engines developed by the PSA concern for use on cars of the B, C, D, M segments. The engines are built as part of a common concept, common rail injection, turbocharging. Two motors of this generation are used, 1.6 HD and 2.0 HD. Motor type 1.6 HD3. Technical features. Displacement. 1,560 cubic centimeters, 75.0 times 85.3, compression ratio, 16.0. Aluminum cylinder block with forged crankshaft. 
aluminum block head, 8 valve single shaft timing, with toothed belt drive and hydraulic compensators in the valve drive. There are no balance shafts. The location of the turbocharger is in front of the engine in the direction of the car. It was offered in two versions, basic with Honeywell variable geometry turbocharger, simplified with Mitsubishi fixed geometry turbocharger. In addition to turbochargers, the engines differ in power systems, Continental with 7-hole piezoelectric type injectors and a working pressure in the system of 2000 bar, Bosch with electromagnetic type nozzles with 8 holes and a system pressure of 1900 bar. The rest of the motors are identical. The exhaust system is a two-way converter and a particulate filter. In the version for countries with environmental standards Euro 4 and below, a particulate filter may be absent. Ecological class, Euro 5. Compared with the engines of the previous generation, a set of measures has been applied on the engines aimed at increasing the efficiency of the engine and reducing harmful emissions, primarily emissions of nitrogen oxides. The compression ratio is lowered to 16.0, an exhaust gas recirculation system is used, the diameter of the combustion chamber in the piston is increased, intake losses are reduced and the level of turbulence in air flows is reduced. Despite the 8-valve timing architecture, at the time of the release of the Citroën C4, this engine was one of the most advanced units in its class, and the transition to a simpler design compared to the previous 16-valve 2003 had no effect on consumer characteristics, which were even improved, increased power throughout the entire rev range, with a shift in maximum power to a zone of lower revs, the noise level is reduced, and the specific fuel consumption is reduced. Options asterisk index DV6 CTED4, model year 2009 to 112 horsepower. Asterisk index DV6 DTED4, 2009 model, 92 horsepower. Motor type 2.0 HD3. Technical features, displacement, 1997 cubic centimeters, 85.0 times 88.0. Compression ratio, 16.0. Cast iron cylinder block with forged crankshaft. Aluminum block head, 16 valve twin shaft timing, with a combined belt chain drive and hydraulic compensators in the valve drive. There are no balance shafts. The location of the turbocharger is behind the engine in the direction of the car. Honeywell variable geometry turbocharger. Intake manifold with dual ducts of different lengths for each of the intake valve pairs. The power supply system is Delphi with electromagnetic type nozzles with 8 holes and a working pressure in the system of 2000 bar. The exhaust system is a two-way converter and a particulate filter. Ecological class, Euro 5. As on the 1.6 HD engine, a similar set of measures was applied to increase the efficiency of the engine and reduce emissions of nitrogen oxides and carbon dioxide. Gearboxes. Five-speed manual gearbox own development of the PSA concern. It was also installed on the Peugeot 307. The four-speed automatic transmission was developed by the PSA Concern in collaboration with the Renault Concern in 2001 for gasoline engines up to 2 liters. The fourth modification of the box was used on the machine. This is a shaftless type hydromechanical automatic machine on planetary gearboxes with a torque converter. Algorithm for shifting gears of an adaptive type, according to the driving style of the driver. The box also has a manual control system of the Tiptronic registered Porsche type. Gear change is carried out by longitudinal movement of the lever according to the scheme first massively used on Porsche cars, while downshifting, by pushing the lever to the rear non-fixed position, and increasing the gear, by pushing the lever to the front non-fixed position. The six-speed manual, developed for the PSA by Borg Warner, is capable of handling motors with torque up to 400 newton meters, is highly reliable and has crisp, short lever strokes. Six-speed robotic gearbox, type EGS developed by PSA independently in 2007 in collaboration with Borg Warner, Shafts and Gears, and Magneti Marelli, Control Electronics. Two-shaft gearbox of the mechanical type on gears with synchronizers, with one clutch and electro-hydraulic actuators. On compact class cars, this is the only box among all single-clutch robots designed from scratch. The box does not have a donor of units and mechanisms among other boxes used by PSA, but on the contrary, it is itself a donor for six-speed manual boxes. Compared to a six-speed manual gearbox, the weight of the robot is only 15 kilograms more. At the time of its creation, it was perhaps the lightest serial six-speed gearbox operating in automatic mode. In terms of adaptability to the specific requirements of the driver in motion, 
it is at the level of the best automatic transmissions in the world. However, changing gears, due to the presence of only one clutch, occurs with a break in the flow of power, which is accompanied by some push. Due to the design, it is extremely reliable, not prone to overheating and slippage. PSA claims that when it was created, all the positive experience of participation of the concerns cars and motorsport was used, Peugeot, in the World Endurance Championship, Citroën, in the World Rally Championship. The gearbox can also be controlled by paddle shifters. Suspension. Front wheel drive, with the transverse arrangement of the power unit. It is the simplest and most common design, front suspension, McPherson type, lower L-shaped lever, rear suspension, torsion beam, coil springs. Despite some primitiveness of the suspension, the car has a quite acceptable level of comfort, and handling can be rated as very good. Steering. Steering, rack and pinion with electric power and variable effort depending on the speed. The rear suspension beam provides a steering effect on high traction surfaces. The steering effect is manifested when braking on an arc as a pulling of the car into the inside of the turn. When the brake pedal is released abruptly, the opposite effect is observed, the machine shifts to a larger radius. Safety. The following systems are commercially used as active safety elements on the machine. Anti-lock brakes, ABS. Eighth generation. Electronic brake force distribution, EBD. Four circuit pressure regulator in the brake line of each wheel, depending on the static and dynamic longitudinal and transverse loads on the wheels during braking. Allows you to brake in turns of any radius. Emergency stop assist, AFU. The amplifier of pressure in a brake line in case of need of emergency braking. Optionally applied systems. Dynamic stabilization, ESP. Eighth generation, has its own processor, position sensor in space and transverse and longitudinal acceleration sensors. Able to deal with both the drift of the car outside the turn and extinguish the amplitude of skidding. Anti-slip, ASR. Included in the previous one, assistance when starting on a slope. Only on machines with a 1.6 HD diesel engine and a robotic gearbox. Installed on cars 1.6 with automatic transmission 2011. Blind spot monitoring. Informs the driver about the presence of a car located in a possibly obscure area of the exterior rear view mirrors. Packages and options. The model was first presented at the Paris Motor Show in September 2010. The start of sales of the model in Europe is March 2011. The European buyer was offered three or four, depending on the country of sale, fixed configurations, differing in a consistently increasing set of included options, one or two trims for a corporate customer, plus usually one special trim that most closely matches Citroën's marketing goals in that market. Also, for each configuration, a small set of additional options was offered, the installation of which was carried out at the request of the customer. Obtaining a unique machine from the basic configuration by stringing only the options the customer needs is impossible. External differences in configurations are minimal, decorative and aerodynamic elements are almost identical. Body colors, 8. The interior is a combination of a single color and multi-texture base for absolutely all trim levels, which includes all interior elements, except for seat upholstery and inserts in door panels. Seat upholstery and door panels which form the basis of the interior color scheme, are presented in two colors, dark and light, and four seat upholstery textures, two fabric options, fabric plus leather, leather. As a result, it gives six textured and color trim options. Options, typical for cars in the market segment since the beginning of the 2010s, and are either functions or devices aimed at improving the ease of operation of the car in normal modes and driving safety, or various seating functionality and interior transformation. Of the options that are quite rare for C-segment cars, only a panoramic glass roof, a blind spot monitoring system and a system for determining an available parking space can be noted. There are basically no options of a pseudo-sport character. The six engines used can be divided into three power levels, one petrol and one diesel in each level. Economy, gasoline 98 horsepower and diesel 92 horsepower medium, gasoline 120 horsepower and diesel 112 horsepower upper gasoline 156 horsepower and diesel 150 horsepower. Despite some simplicity of the suspension, the invariance of its architecture, regardless of the engine used, and the absence of optional design elements free to order that in any way affect handling, Citroen quite carefully approached the factory chassis setting, five shock absorber options, 
or front stabilizer options, two options for the rear stabilizer, its own set of springs for each power unit, two steering rack options, not counting the same number for right-hand drive cars, more than 10. Options for power steering pumps. The machine can use rims with a diameter of 15 to 18 inches, and tires up to 225 millimeters profile width. Like another brand of the PSA concern, Peugeot, Citroën places special emphasis on the low cost of maintenance of its cars during the warranty period. Maintenance frequency in Europe is once a year or every 20,000 kilometers, whichever comes first. Planned routine maintenance during maintenance, minimal volume, low complexity and, therefore, low price. Also, service contracts are common, aimed at further reducing the cost of scheduled maintenance. This especially distinguishes the brand from Japanese manufacturers, and in particular from Toyota, whose maintenance cost in Europe over a comparable period is approximately three to three and a half times higher. Warranty in Europe, three years or 100,000 kilometers. Model in Russia. The start of sales of the model in Russia is May 2011, two months after the European one. Initially, three fixed configurations were offered, dynamic, tendance, exclusive, eight colors and four interior options plus optional leather interior. At the time of the start of sales, the choice of powertrains was limited to the 1.6 VTI engine, complete with either a 5-speed manual gearbox or a 4-speed automatic transmission. This was explained by the fact that in Russia only cars assembled at the PSA concern plant in Kaluga from car kits were sold, and for 2011 the Kaluga plant, for various reasons, did not receive other power units from France. A little later. A power unit was added from the January 6, 2002 engine and a 5-speed manual gearbox, also assembled in Kaluga. And even later, a power unit from a 1.6 HD 112 engine complete with a 6-speed gearbox and a start-stop system. The overall level of configurations and possible options, in general, turned out to be similar to the European one, with the exception of a couple of options that do not function in Russia, a system for calling help, etc. All cars made in Russia received the Russian pack package of improvements, additional protection of the engine compartment from below, a high-capacity battery, and a suspension for difficult conditions. The value of this package cannot be unequivocally assessed, the car has become a little higher and a little softer, but it has lost controllability. The frequency of scheduled maintenance in Russia is 20,000 kilometers or one year of operation, whichever comes first. The manufacturer also recommends changing the engine oil and oil filter every 10,000 kilometers. The body of the car, according to the European tradition, is made of high-quality metal, galvanized, as an additional surface primer in places of greatest contact with the external environment and a 12-year guarantee against through corrosion. The 1.6 VTI motor, which was installed on the vast majority of cars sold, source not specified 52 days is most suitable for operation in Russian conditions. Without any deterioration in consumer characteristics, the motor turned out to be able to constantly operate on 95th gasoline and oil waste due to its possible damage due to refueling with low-quality gasoline does not affect the engine's performance. The integrated valve timing system is reliable, and since sales in Russia, since 2008, this motor has not had any known cases of either replacement or lengthy repairs during the warranty period. Despite the fact that diesel engines of the PSA concern had been offered in Russia on other cars of the concern for more than one year by the time the model was released, and with the right assessment by the owner of the choice of filling stations for gas stations, they proved to be reliable and trouble-free, the 1.6 HD 112 engine for 2011 turned out to be the first engine with piezoelectric type injectors, injectors that are extremely demanding on fuel quality. There are no statistics on the operation of engines with these nozzles in Russia for 2011. Choosing a car with this engine will require from the owner in Russia increased responsibility for the approach to choosing gas stations.